The Sims 4 recently put out these new scenarios, which are basically like gameplay challenges that you can try in The Sims 4. They range from different difficulties to different themes and they change out every so often. I was scrolling through these and this one caught my eye. The no skills, no problem scenario. It's an intermediate scenario challenge, kind of like rags to riches, but with a twist. It says a Sim cannot seem to ever get more skillful at, well, anything. It's made everything more difficult from interpersonal relationships to holding a steady job. And as a result, they've had to become quite resourceful, figuring out ways to work harder or smarter than everyone else. Can this unskilled sim figure out how to hack life and earn some sweet simoleons? This is our sim we're gonna be using for this challenge. Her name is Naomi Kim and I've set her up hopefully for success. I gave her the curator aspiration, which apparently gives you this reward trait called the appraiser. And appraisers can sell collectibles like things you find around the Sims 4 world for more money. I also gave her the self-assured trait. We're gonna be more confident more often. We're adventurous and we're cheerful, meaning we're happy more often. Basically, the goal here is to make as much money as possible or 400,000 simoleons to like finish the scenario without the use of skills, which if you think about it, skills are really the backbone of making money in The Sims 4. From selling like masterpieces to selling perfect plants from your garden, it really is a hack. It's gold. Oh, I should tell you guys, I also gave my Sim two part-time jobs. I was scrolling through trying to figure out which was the best option here. So I'm a lawnmower, which pays $45 an hour. And I'm a diver, also $45 an hour. So I mean, $135 from day one, our part-time job, not too bad, but not gonna get us to that goal very quickly. I got a few ideas. So I'm gonna get my sim ready for this day and we're gonna head out. So one thing that I learned while researching is boat salvaging, which I had no idea was a thing. I'm basically gonna be a pirate. These boats get like abandoned in the lagoon and they randomly like respawn. So I'm gonna get on this and swim it over to my lot and see if I can just sell it from there. There's something so satisfying about like stealing things in The Sims 4. Like I never ever obviously would do that in my real life, but Sims stealing things to me is just hilarious. I am literally about to jack this boat. While I'm here, we can also scope out the beach and see if there's any collectibles that we can find. I'm gonna be like beach combing. Home beach for trash. I haven't really spent a whole lot of time in Sulani doing things like this, but I am curious to see how much money. Oh, hello. I'm curious to see how much money I can really make doing this. Okay, so we're gonna get off this boat. 1,800 simoleons, that's actually pretty good. I see another one over here, so I'm just gonna be stealing these boats all freaking day. Honestly, my coworkers can probably see me. Like, I work as a diver. I'm sure someone is around here that I work with. Probably not a good look. Let me see if I can find anything good in here. And I also wanna place my earbuds in the world. We're gonna sell those. Oh my God, another one respawned. Okay, this is a good way to do this. If you have the Sims 4 Island living, stealing boats is the way to get the cash. Oh, don't mind me. These people totally know what I'm up to. Let's go say hello. Oh, does that, is that Sim okay? <laughs> What's going on? Oh my God. <laughs> She is glitching right out. She must be, right? Oh, she's dazed. What the heck happened? No, get off the boat. Get off the boat. Leave it. Leave. No, we're doing it wrong. So we've got one pretty sustainable income with our boat stealing. Let's see if I can find a friend. We need to we need to introduce ourselves to some people. Maybe they'll send us gifts. Also, why is everyone on this island uh, dazed? Like, what is going on? We're off to work day one. I have 5,000 simoleons in the bank. I need to make this happen a little bit faster. How many people are showing up to my house right now? Oh, they have extra food they're bringing. Oh, that's nice. I thought it was the welcome wagon, but they showed up with actually good food. Oh, I feel bad. The only thing I'm eating is cereal because I don't want to spend money on anything. So this is actually really sweet. No, 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 wait. Oh, they left it. Oh, thank you, nice people. I feel so mean. They like dropped the food and left, but I'm going to still eat this though. Thank you. Dust bunnies. Oh my gosh. We are not going to be cleaning at all. I want all the dust bunnies in here. I know it's a fire hazard, but they will get us some quick cash. Apparently you can send these off. Ask Dust Bunny to search for valuables. Okay, hold on. I need to go and feed the Dust Bunnies. The friend, I wanna be your friend. Pet it, okay, yes. Let's show this thing some love. Is this cute? In theory, no, but I mean, it makes the cutest little noises. I always feel bad to step on them. Befriend. Yes. We're gonna have a whole army of these. Oh, and okay, good. They can find rarer items and occasionally even dig up substantial piles of simoleons. 
that's what I want. 33 simoleons. Oh my gosh. Okay, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna tend to our dust buddy and we're gonna search out day two of being a pirate. The heart of Sulani. <gasps> Wait, that's actually pretty expensive. I feel like I should save the more pricey things and sell them on a table. There are tables where you can put like items on them and then rack up the price. So I think I might save those and sell them that way. <gasps> What's this? Ooh, now we're finding rare things and I have to work. Okay, I'm gonna keep doing this until I have to go. We're off to work. Hopefully I get a promotion. I mean, we're not working for many hours at these part-time jobs, but they're paying a decent amount. So I'm wondering how much I can make if I do get promoted. Oh yes. Okay, we got promoted $59 an hour, but we only work a few hours. We got a scuba dive tank. I might be able to sell that for $0. Why? <laughs> Literally why? Okay, I'm just gonna put this out here. I think I'm gonna change up my plan and we're gonna try and find someone to come along this journey with us. I hope I don't drown. This is actually kind of dangerous. This is like a one-way ticket to death. <laughs> okay, yeah, go home. Please don't drown on the way. I have way more to do. Ooh, I wanna go to the bar. Okay, we should go to the bar tomorrow and see if we can find a potential love interest to help us out. Normally, it'll say if it has to be only like one or two sims, but I don't have that here. So I think that's fair game. Ooh, there's another one. We have two dust bunnies now. Okay, we have to be friends with this one. I actually want to purchase one of those tables that I can sell stuff with. I think it comes with the Sims 4 City Living. Maybe I'll just put it like right here on my lot. I can have my own little store and then we'll see if people come to me. Then we don't even have to leave. All right, all of this stuff that I found over the past couple days, I'm gonna sell all of this. We'll put this on my table. Mark up prices. We're gonna stock them all the way up to 300%. You are not getting a good deal at this garage sale. Okay, start. I can see you guys. I know you're right there. Wait a minute. Do you think I could sell the boats? <laughs> no, right? Do you think? I'm I'm too curious. I don't think I can put a boat in my inventory, right? Okay, I'm gonna quickly go over and steal this one and see if I can do that. That would be so good. I could start a boat selling business. I've called to inform you that your great, great, grand second once removed cousin's grand whatever has passed away for some reason, has left a vast fortune specifically to you. Will you accept? I forget which one is which, but this is the one that makes you get married in seven days and they give you a lot of cash. My sim just got home from work. She made like 175 dollars. It's not gonna cut it. I feel like we need to go to the bar and get ourselves married. Why is every person on this island dazed? I don't know about my potential spouse yet, but I've met some people at the bar. What is going on over here? Oh my god, it's Tharn! This is way more bumping. Okay, I want to marry this sim because I feel like this sim has a lot of money, but I don't know how to talk to them. Attempt introduction. I hate how you can like never talk to them. Oh my god, I like, oh, ask for a hug. Come on. Okay, fine. Why am I wasting my time with you when there's way more people over here? Wait, why am I talking to you when Makoa, the sweetheart, is over here? Everyone loves Makoa. Like, it's a known thing in The Sims 4. He's got something weird going on with his hair currently, but nothing a little makeover can't fix. We're gonna marry Makoa. You know what? When The Sims 4 Island Living came out, everybody was marrying Makoa. My Sim never got the opportunity, all right? So I think we're gonna do that. You've got a job. Oh, wait, yeah, you're literally working. Okay, P pursue your dream job. That would be great. I don't feel like I know you well enough to be having this conversation. I mean, fair enough. Imagine you just met someone and they're like, you should go pursue your dream job. It's kind of weird because I need to be careful. Like, I don't know if I gain any skills, if the scenario will just end. Like, I don't want to tell a joke in my conversations here and then have my comedy skill go up. And then I fail the scenario. So I'm going to say, this is actually going pretty well. This is really cute. I wish we could have hung out at this like fire festival a little bit more. But we're going to stargaze. I feel like that's kind of nice and romantic. Yeah, this is cute. This is really nice for our first interaction. We're feeling inspired. She really has to use the bathroom though. Luckily, we're not too far from home. But this was really nice. This is, could totally work out. Okay, go home. Let's go home. Let's not embarrass ourselves in front of Makoa. We need to leave. Nice meeting you. I still haven't befriended this one dust bunny and I'm scared it's gonna turn on me. Okay, let's try this table again. We're gonna start bright and early. I've got my stuff on the table. We're gonna hike it up. Oh, yes, yes, people. Okay, there's three of you. Come on, come on. Yes. Yes, yes, we had a sale. Nice. Okay, I need to go back to that beach location and get more of that because that was amazing. Maybe we can go with Makoa. Oh, who is literally right here just dropping and doing some push-ups. I'm kind of also debating quitting my job. I don't know if it's paying enough for me. Cute, hello. They're adorable. Like they are gonna be the cutest couple. So I wonder if I do marry someone, if they're able to gain skills or if it's just my sim that's not able to. I guess we're gonna test it out. Oh, we can do this together too. Oh, cute. 
cute. Okay, so we can beach comb, beach comb for trash. I found a trophy. <gasps> Those are pricey. Oh my God, I should open up like a beach pawn shop, like things that I just find. I mean, I guess that's kind of what we're doing. I love that Makoa is helping us. Okay, work starts for me in an hour. I found a couple good things, I guess, for my yard sale. A roast chicken, that's freaking nasty. Yeah, 177. I mean, I'm really not making too much cash from this. Oh, we got another dust bunny. Okay, you guys need to step it up. If my was gonna quit my job, I'm gonna need you guys to get some rare stuff. <laughs> Look at this little squad. You can get some pretty gnarly fires from these, so we gotta be kinda careful. <gasps> yes! Oh my god! 10,000 simoleons for that. We are selling the crap out of this. Yes, dust bunnies! 10,000 simoleons for this plate sold as is. If I hike that up, we gonna be good. These oh, dust bunnies yes. are the freaking best. Talk like a pirate day. You know what? I'm quitting. I'm quitting. I don't wanna be a lawnmower. Let's take a vacation day, actually. I'm gonna use those up before we quit so that at least we'll get the pay and then we'll quit. <laughs> that is cheating the system at its finest, but I don't even care, okay? We gotta hustle. <laughs> at this point, my life revolves around these little balls of fluff. Okay, we're gonna do a yard sale real quick. I think my table might be glitching out because it says it's full, but I don't really have much on there. I'm having issues with my table. Like, it won't let me stock the whole thing. I really need you guys to buy this though because that is so freaking expensive. Please. Yes, yes, they bought it. Yeah, there's something glitching about my yard sale here. Are you gonna buy that? <laughs> So I named them <laughs> and the Sims named them randomly. Oh. Mochi, we've got Chonk, which is my favorite. And we have Buttons. Actually, Buttons is really cute too. We have hit 20K, which is still not that great. I'm gonna invite Makoa to hang out. Hopefully it's not too early. Today's the day. We need to start pulling the romance. We need to get ourselves that 20K. Oh my God, he's gonna see my Dust Bunny collection. He's gonna be like, what is that? And I'm exhausted. Oh, this was not a good idea. Let's see if the romance will work. Let's start to flirt with Makoa, see if it happens. Wait a minute, Makoa is married. How did I not know this? How did I not know? That's why this isn't going very well. Dang, why did I assume that he wasn't married? My Sims always run into this problem, always. How's that gonna go over? No, he's leaving. He saw that coming. He's like, I gotta get out of here. I gotta go support my family. I feel bad. Oh my God, I feel bad that Makoa's married, but also I, I have how many days? Two days to get married. The sun is setting. Let's see if maybe we can go over here to the beach. We can go here together, have like a nice little beach sunset afternoon and see if we can get that first kiss and also convince him to leave his wife. In my defense, I swear I thought he was single. I don't know why. I feel like I remember watching like Claire Siobhan's Let's Play, like when The Sims 4 Island Living came out and I think she married Makoa. So that's why my brain is like tracing back to that, I think. Okay, this is going well. We have the first kiss option. Aw, we love it. Ask to be boyfriend? He said yes to that. Oh my God. Okay, that went really well. I only have how many more days until this runs out though? Two days. Okay, we need this to happen like tomorrow. I hope he doesn't get mad about my boat stealing business. I could see him not really liking that. Oh, he's still here. I thought he left. He doesn't mind my bu my dust bunnies. In the morning, we propose. Oh no, they can't woo. <laughs> that sucks. Okay, let me see if I can propose. I really hope that this doesn't mess with the scenario. I'm proposing, please don't say no. He said yes. Oh, I, I kind of felt like he was saying no. I should have done that in a more cute location. Why did I just automatically think that would be a no? We have to have a wedding. We should see if the weddings are broken. Let's plan a wedding event. This is going to cost money though. That's the only thing. Rehearsal, dinner, you know what? We're not doing all that. We're going to keep it cheap. We're going to elope, I think. Or, or maybe we could go to like the beach and do it somewhere. We could just go to the wedding venue, use the arch, skip the whole paying and the whole party situation. That's how you cheat the system. We are all about that today. <laughs> Where's the arch? Oh my God, there it is. We're literally just gonna go and walk in and get married here. <gasps> But it's cute, it's on like a platform. I've actually never been here before. This venue is really pretty. Oh, I like how that flooring is like that too. Okay, <laughs> back to the task at hand here. We're gonna get married and Makoa is literally wearing the swim gear. I can't. Cute though, there's like people watching from the window. Oh, Wait, no. it's kind of creepy. He's literally taking pictures from outside. He doesn't like the decor. Oh my God, he doesn't like queen and decor. Makoa, focus here. We know you're cute. We know, we get it. Look at it. What are you guys doing from out there? So creepy. There's people like creeping on my wedding. Yes, we got the 20,000 simoleons. Thank goodness. Okay, moving in together. Okay, split from household and move. Let's go. Shall I take the money? I mean, I feel like it's a little bit cheaty, but it's also like I'm kind of not cheating. 
I'm gonna do it. It's still getting the money without skills. So we made like $40,000 from that. No, oh no, you're about to modify a household that has a scenario in progress. Your changes might cause the scenario to end depending on the goals of the scenario. Are you sure you wanna do this? No, Makoa can't move with us. What if I don't take any money? Dang it, I can't do that. Makoa, you're gonna have to stay with your family. Yikes. So we're married, but like not really. <laughs> we're married, but we don't live together. Oh no. Okay. Well, that backfired just a little bit. But I mean, we did get that insurance money and we just didn't get his money. Damn. Oh, she's so happy though. Oh, how how tragic. We just broke up a marriage. Can't even, can't even enjoy it. That is so upsetting. I guess we'll just go home. I kind of have an idea. What if I used other people to come over and use their skills and I will benefit from it? <laughs> I have an idea. I did a rags to riches challenge on my channel before and what I did was had my sim join a painting group. They were painting themselves too, but what if I made a group, had everyone come over and paint, but sold the things that they used? Because I think their skill would go up while we do that, right? Okay, what I'm gonna do, we're gonna go into build mode. I'm gonna delete this stuff over here and I'm gonna replace all of that with easels. Can't remember how many people I can have in a group, but I'm gonna have as many people as possible and they're all gonna come over and paint and then I'm gonna sell their paintings. And I'm hoping that their skills are gonna go up and their paintings will then become more expensive, like worth more money. We're gonna create a club here. This comes with the Sims 4 get together and we're gonna, we're gonna call it Spicy Painters. <laughs> Come up your skills and paint for free. Requirements, skill level two plus in the painting skill. Actually, you know what? We'll take everyone. We'll take everything we can get. We're gonna remove that. Club activities, painting. I also have a woodworking thing. So I guess we could add that. I'm gonna invite literally everybody that I know other than your wife, Makoa. No your ex-wife not happening. Okay, and then eventually we can unlock more points and add more members. This is gonna work. I feel a little bit evil. There we go. Okay, let's do a get together now. Start gathering. I'm pretty sure you can just like have these people over like all day, every day. So with that, plus our pirate stealing, plus our dust bunnies, we're gonna make the cash. We got this. Yes, our group members are coming in. Okay, everybody get on to your paint easel. Honestly, this would be such a vibe doing this near the water. And maybe we've got some skill in here. Like, that looks pretty good so far. We got some woodworking happening over on the side. I'm literally using Sims for labor right now. It's funny because I literally can't even participate. I'm just gonna come in and like chat with everyone, like give them that moral support, you know? I can't pick up a paintbrush because then I'm gonna end up gaining my skills. I am also going to get this from City Living, the street gallery, so that I can put the paintings on there and sell those as well. We are really trying to get the most out of our money today. <laughs> I've kind of just been letting the painting club go at it. like leaving it on the entire time. And I've been racking up points that way. So I'm gonna use my perks, add another spot so that I can increase my capacity and add another sim. And then now we have more painters, but I need everyone to come in here and oh, get, get going. Okay, there they are. <laughs> and they're gonna still be working on more paintings and more inventory while their skills are just going up. This is great. My house is disgusting. I mean, everyone's kind of like staying here for free and eating my food, but now everything is breaking and it's getting even more dusty. This is so chaotic. I think she's gonna go and try and kick this person off of the boat. <laughs> Who is that? Jeffrey Landgrab, go girl, go. Oh, he's going so far away, get him. <laughs> so we've got two businesses on the go right now. We've got our painting oh, business God. and we also have our boat stealing pirate business. <laughs> Both of them are going well. They're just a little bit slow. Like I've been doing this for quite some time now and I only got 64,000 simoleon. I am noticing though that our paintings are becoming better quality. So hopefully they're gonna start to sell for a lot more money. I think I might've made enough points just by letting it rack up. I think now I can get this where it's like a painting boost where my painting skills are gonna go up in the club. So their skills are gonna go up while I'm selling their stuff. So, okay, what happens if I plant these? Like, what if I put this on my lot? Can I plant these here without her skill going up? Like, let's say I get her to come over here and do it. Is my skill gonna go anywhere? Okay, wait, I thought I was gonna be unable to do any of this stuff because that would require like a skill to do that. I haven't been planting this stuff because I thought it wasn't even possible, but if I can plant stuff and sell my plants, it's over. Hold on, am I able to actually paint too? I mean, my skill can't go up, so I feel like that would be a waste of time, but I'm pretty sure the game just said it so that your skills won't go up, but you can still do stuff. 
I was under the impression that I had to do something that required no skill at all. So on top of all my other businesses that we've got going on, now I can also do gardening. We just hit over 100,000. Okay, this is gonna skyrocket from here. I know it. Now that we know this information, the romance festival is on. I think we're gonna go with Makoa and we're gonna go and steal some of the plants that are there because I know in the romance festival, they have like roses and stuff there that are growing there. So I can go and steal those, plant them on my own island and it's all up from there. And plus I haven't been hanging out with Makoa like at all because I've just been selling and painting and being a pirate. So let's go to San Mashudo. We're gonna go to the romance festival and I think it's over here. Oh, I think we have a thunderstorm too. Oh, here they are. Yes, we're gonna, we're gonna harvest all of this stuff. Over here, we have some berries too. This stuff is worth a decent amount of money and we can replant all of this. I mean, we can make a date out of it. I'm here to steal things, but Makoa seems to be supportive. Jeffrey. Jeffrey came here for revenge. Oh, no, not a double date with the land grabs. Makoa's like, I'm out of here. Okay, so we're home. Let's try and plant these. We've got our garden coming along quite nicely over here. Oh my God, we stole so much. Okay, let's put all of this down. We're gonna plant everything. Uh oh, there's a fire. Not my dust bunnies. Where is the fire? Oh my God, I hope it's not my dust bunnies. I am relying on them. They're, they're employees. Makoa's discovered the fire? Where? Everyone seems to be heading over this way. Oh my God, is Makoa on fire? Oh, it's right here. No. Extinguish. Oh, no, no, no. We can't get to the fire. Someone's blocking the way. Not the merchandise. It's okay. I got this. I got this. Oh, oh. Wait, do we get insurance money for this? No. No. Okay, we're good. We did get insurance money. I'm not even going to bother replacing that as long as all this stuff is good. My priorities are all over the place. Makoa is fine, I think. But the merchandise, the merchandise is good. I think if all of these are out of season, if I build like a roof over top of them, then it should be okay. Even if we don't make it too special, I'm still trying to save my money. I can just like make a little like hut like this. And then we can put this out front. I can still sell all of my stuff at my yard sale, but then all of my plants are gonna go under the roof and I'm hoping that helps. Now all our plants are growing. Oh, this is good. This is good. We are on our way. These Sims are working in like the worst working conditions. Like labor laws do not apply. Look how dirty it is in here. I have like one toilet that sometimes breaks, um, but it's fine. They're starting to sell for more money though. Like at least a thousand dollars we're getting per painting. I'd like to think that we're saving up to spend money on a big house for all of us. Like a Hype house, but in The Sims, where we there's no hype. We finally have some growth on my plants here. I'm gonna harvest all, we're gonna replant, and then hope for the best. These ones actually grew pretty fast. And all of these things that I'm planting, I've found basically from the dust bunnies, like anything that they can grab for me so I don't have to go elsewhere to find the seeds. 16,000 simoleons in my inventory right here. Yes, my painters are helping me do this too. Oh my God, they're the best. This is quite the tropical garden. We have like coconut trees. I've got a plasma fruit, tree of a mo Emotions? This tree swirls with mysterious energy. The fruit from this tree is reported to trigger a range of emotional responses from the Sims who eat them. What is that? Okay, I'm gonna replant every single thing that I got. I'm probably only gonna do this one more time because I'm running out of room. That tree is so cool. It's like glowing. Plasma fruit is for vampires. So, I mean, it makes sense that it kind of looks like that, but I've never seen one of those. One hour later. I can see the light. My Sims life has been so miserable, just picking up trash and living in oh. Trash and petting dust bunnies, but I have over 300,000 simoleons now. My plants are ripe again. I'm gonna just keep selling all of it. I'm not gonna be replanting, even though I'm sure there's a better way to be doing this. Oh, we're getting so close. Cool. It's almost my birthday. That's how long I've been doing this. My sim, my poor sim, poor Naomi, <laughs> is almost an adult, her entire young adult life doing this. I mean, if we can get it done before that, then at least she can live her whole adulthood just chilling. Okay, I think today might be the day. We're hard. Harvesting. I've got some stuff in my inventory that I'm gonna be able to sell for my dust bunnies that I've been hustling. Wait, these are expensive. I think these are worth like 10 grand, 30. Oh wait, we're gonna be so close. Let me just sell this while she's doing that. We need 3,000 simoleons. Ooh, less. Okay, let's go, let's go. We might get it with all of these plants that she's selling. Is there anything I can sell on the board? I have one. Do we have any paintings that are complete? Oh yeah, you guys are doing so good. Okay, screw this. We're gonna go and get all those plants and host hopefully our last garage sale. I have a full inventory of paintings for my freaking workers over here. All right, let's go load this up. I still have stuff over here that I can sell too, but I think this will be faster. Oh my God, please, someone just buy this. Anyone? Oh, you, come on, come on, come on. Oh, this kid. Oh my God, tell me this kid is not 
not going to be the way to awesome. the 400 grand. Come on, kid. Please just, just buy my whole stock. Oh, no, he left. Buy it, buy it, buy it. 800. Okay, okay. I need to sell like one more. Maybe I can get it just from selling all of that instead. I did it. I did it. I did it. I did it. I did it with the plants. Scenario complete. Oh my gosh. That took so long. The outcome. I'm a scrappy sim. I don't even know what that means. Game time elapsed 21 days. That's how long it freaking took for this. Oh my god. All right. This one's definitely more fun than the other ones. Would recommend. It's kind of like rags to riches, but I find I found that pretty hard. I don't know. You really rely on the skills to get the money when you're when you're trying to do this. But let me know if you guys have tried this challenge in the comment section down below. Let me know if you want to see me do any more since four scenarios because I have fun doing them. If you liked the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.